Baraka. I think you've been waiting for me. Yeah. Pablo Duarte, you with the company? Not exactly. They're gonna be a problem. If you can help keep money from going to those communist bastards in Cuba, then no. You with the Cuban Revolutionary Council? I made it through that disaster back in 61. Ended up here. I still have connections, though. It's how Frank Pagani's smuggling operation got on my radar. His man, Pops Holland, runs the freight yard. Does a lot of business with Havana. <laughs> All that commie talk about common ownership is so much bullshit is sickening. Those hijos de puta only care about money. Since losing River Row, Pops has had to resort to airdrops. They move them around, so you'll have to find out where they're happening. I'm sure Pops' people will be more than happy to help me out. I'll be back, Pablo. The fuckers working for Pops Holland know what he's up to. You're gonna need to get at them. Someone in Holland's organization has info on the airdrops. Find him. Junior Holland's related to Pops, right? Pops isn't gonna like you going after his family. The way I understand it, Holland gets along with his boss, Frank Pagani, because they're both family men. Half of Marcano's organization was built on illegal freight. <laughs> Holy shit! You know Alma? Fuck! Tell her Pablo says he owes her a drink. Pops Holland has been around, but don't let his age fool you. Old bastard can still put up a fight. You ever try to airdrop cargo in a hurricane? Piece of advice. Don't.